Hi everyone, welcome to Geranderlandia. I'm your host, Jer, and Ander, Jer, Ander, sometimes known as Jer, sometimes known as Jay. Um, I got the beacon working. Let me show you what I did. If the dolphin's gonna interrupt. Ooh, yep. See, oh, yep. See, there's some dirt here, evidence that somebody's been working. Oh! Dolphins are not as helpful as they think they are. Oh, all right. So what I did was put everything one block down. So here's the beacon down here. I put yellow glass to change the color, and then I put the iron inside down here. And so that gives me, what does that give me? It gives me speed. So that's nice. Speed is nice. And that's it. That's, I just want to make sure you saw this. Oh, all right. Now, what are we going to do? After the adventure of last episode, I have to say I'm not really craving adventure, but I am. So I'm going to do a little adventure. We'll see you in just a moment. Hi, everyone. Um, here we are back down in the mine. And uh, this is where we fought the wither down here. And I think I need to clean it up a little bit. Oh, yeah, I, I blocked off these. I should I should. I should clean these up. I brought some materials. I don't know if I have. Nothing back here. Okay, well, let's block it off anyway. I could just put a torch and it'd probably be easier, but we can see all the way back here. What's on this other side? I, yeah, I think this is a part of the abandoned mine shaft that I've explored. So let's just do this to indicate that I have explored it so I don't get, I don't get sidetracked. There's some other places to it. Like I should grab this dirt, but I'm not gonna grab that yet. I should clean up the staircase because I keep bonking my head. There's certain places that need to be um, mob-proofed. But what I want to do is take care of the spider spawner at the other side. I want to light it up. I want to see what's in there. The things, places where I dug out resources when I was digging this little tunnel. Oh. I don't think I left any resources behind. Just, just that dirt, maybe. I don't like dirt mining. I like mining dirt because sometimes it reveals other resources and it's usually pretty easy to do. I hear it. Oh, I did leave some resources behind. I think I was too flustered to even notice these were here. That was a very adventuresome adventure I had and I, I don't do well with adventures. Well, oh, there's gold. And I left all sorts of stuff here. This. Take some stone. Put a torch for now. Okay, can you hear it? I think it's right around here. Hi. Hi, guys. I can't... Can I... What if I do this? That's it. That's it. That was less than, uh, less adventure. Oh, hi. Come here. That's a less adventure than I thought it would be. What's in the chest? Ooh. Oh, is that the, my first one? Maybe. Maybe. All right, um, so I have to remember where this is. Oh, and there's coal, too. I have to remember where this is. Like, we can build a spider spawner here, a grinder of some sort. Um, I'm going to clean it out a little bit, and I'll be back in just a moment. Hi. Uh, quick update. Diamonds. I'm glad I cleaned this out. Glad I took the time. Not that I know what to do with diamonds at this point, but diamonds are fun, right? Diamonds are a girl's best friend. So, see in a little bit. Hi, everyone. Here I stand, lead in hand, wondering where this wandering trader came from. Where'd it go? And now I'm wondering where it went. Oh, well, there it is. Um, into the water apparently is the place that wandering traders like to go. They like to lead their llamas there, and they like to uh, leave this lead behind. I wonder if I can lead them both. Lead the trader and lead the llama. But I think the leader is leading the llamas, and that leader is the trader. I just hope they don't stamp, trample my crops. But the sun is going down, so it's time to explain what I'm going to do today. Um, there's a couple of things that have been kind of lingering. Number one is finishing up this area. There's only two major projects to do at that point, and number one is to put that patio area out there, the relaxing lounge area. 
Um, number two is to fix up the staircase down here. So those are the two lingering projects. So this one right here needs to be beautified. And the third one of the two projects is to light up the island around here. Um, I kind of want to get that done, but I've also been spending a lot of time here, and I need to sleep. So the Get Her Done project is one of the lingering projects. Um, another lingering project is something I promised a long time ago, and that was an Ender Ender. And so I think that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to start setting up the Ender Ender. And uh, because I had the Terror last episode, I figured Terror of the Void would be a next, the next logical step. So I'm going to get ready, and we'll see you in a minute. Hi, everyone. Um, in order to get ready for this end run, I first need to go to the Nether. Because while I'm in the end, now that I've... Oops, that was not right. Now that I've done a real weather fight... Oh, I didn't put them in my inventory. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to kill some withers, and I'm going to use wither cheese. In order to do that, I need some soul sand. I could pull that soul sand out, but I'm not going to. Um, I'm going to brave the nether. Hey, I'm wearing gold pants. What the heck? Do they, for do they retain their... Their irritation with me? I guess so. That's unfortunate. I expected that my gold pants would keep me protected, but they did not. Oh, I, I got a gold helmet, though. That's nice. Can I jump down here? Um, soul sand, soul sand. I think my soul sand is this way. Or where I've been getting soul sand is over here. Chicken. Yeah, the nether terrifies me now, especially because of the piglins. Um, not all the piglins, just some of the piglins. Uh, the uh, the unzombified piglins, the non-zombified ones, because our regular pig people, pig people, don't bother me at all. I mean, as long as they don't bother them, they won't bother me. But these other folk, they're just they're just not nice. They're very rude. They have no manners. I should go see what our, I should go see what the fortress is like now. But where did I get soul sand from? I know I got it around from around here somewhere. Now there's terrifying. Yeah, piglins. Piglins. I mean, I don't think they're a good addition to the game. I'm sorry, Mojang. I'm going to question your decision on this one. Let's see. This way? Oh, there's some soul sand over here. I want to dig that soul sand up. Maybe. Oh, this is a, a narrow narrow defile. I don't know if it's a defile. It's something, though. Oh, yeah, here's soul sand. Let's, let's dig some of this up. Maybe dig all of it up. I only need 12, right? If I have... Three, yeah, I have nine more heads... I think this will do. I think this will do. Got a little bit of an adventure, a little bit of terror. I don't like terror. See, this may not be a good place to walk on if a gas comes by. I need to build transportation routes. I need... Uh, look at this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm going to grab this while I'm here. No, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to do this on another adventure. Spread out the adventure. There's only so much adventure I can take at the same time. And there's the freaking gas. Okay, I don't... I, am I going to die? That would not be... Up. That would not be comfortable. Oh, gas. Ha! Ha! Frickin' gas. I should turn off mobs when I'm in the nether. This is... Oh, I got a tear, though. That's good. All right. Now, where the heck am I, and how do I get where I'm going? Gas. See, it's... Why do people like this place? I don't like this place. This is not a good place. So I need to find uh, safe transportation systems through the nether. So I think I'm going to have to go on the roof. And I need to find my way up on the roof. Now that it's 1.16, that may change. Uh, break nether brick and not bedrock or whatever the heck it's called. I don't care anymore. I'm just, I'm just grumpy. Oh, striders. I haven't seen those yet. Let's eat some fish. That's what those are called, right? The lava striders? That's neat. Do I need mushrooms to attract them? How do I... What do, how, those might be a good transportation system. Look at that. They're so... They're so blocky. Like it's Minecraft or something. How do I get up here? I guess I go up this way. All right. Soul sand acquired. Right? I've got a bunch of it. And bonus, I got a, a gas tier. 
I should build a gas tier farm. Is that still a thing? Is that a real thing? I don't know. All right. Oh. Now. Ah. I need to make one more stop on my way to the the, the end. And uh, I'll, I'll show you where I am when I get where I am. Hi, everyone. On my way to... Ooh. Can't do that. Hold on. On my way to the, uh, whatever it's called, the portal, the end, the end portal, I'm passing these, I have passed these pedestals. And remember, this one was a 5x6, and I wasn't sure what to do with it, but I think I'm going to give it a random chance of being a 5x7 or a 5x5. And that's because I, uh, Jamie 10, the same one that's my bow is named after. Jamie 10? No, Jamie, just Jamie H. Just Jamie, just Jamie. Um, same one my bow's named after. Anyway, gave me this idea for the crystals, and that was to base them on the Infinity Stones. It, it, Marvel Comics, Marvel Cinematic Universe, Infinity Stones, you know what we're talking about? So I'm going to have one style of each color. I'm going to have yellow, orange, red, green, blue, and purple. Now, I've got a yellow one over there. I've got these four in front and the one behind me. That's six, so I can build one of each. Um, so, yeah, if I change that one back there to a, an a five by five or a five by seven and so that's what i'm going to do and i'm going to use those as templates you know we've already talked a little bit about templates right and how these pedestals are based on templates and so i'm going to build these pedestals up i think i'm also going to stick to stone for the pedestals not wood or anything like that um so this andesite may come out that on some of them it may there may be granite there may be what's the other one diorite so that's what i'm thinking and there'll be random chances of these. And there'll be random chances of smallest, middlest, or highest. Um, there'll also be random chance of spacing between the crystal and the pedestal. And then all of them need to have beacons. So guess what we're doing right now? We're going to the end. We're going to set up the ender ender. And we're going to adventure. Adventure. Ha ha. You'll find out. See you when we get there. Hi, everyone. Do you remember this place? The end, the end portal, um, these thingies, whatever they're called, silverfish. End is a terrifying place, so here we go. Oh, don't look down. Now, while we're here, I brought some additional materials with me. We're not just going to work on the ender ender, we're going to do something else. Now that I've done a legit wither fight, I think I'm entitled to some wither cheese. And so I have nine more heads, nine more skulls, and I'm going to cheese them. Let's see. Now, I need to do a little bit of preparation here. I think. Because I, I, don't, I don't know if this is going to work. No, I, I don't think I need to do this portion. What I do need to do, this portion. Like that. Then, okay. So I can do this behind. I'm going to throw in these eggs. See if we get any chickens. Well, there's two. Three. That's not bad. Why would I do this, you may ask? That's a very good question. I saw something. And I, I think I know what's going to happen. I didn't bring the withers. I didn't bring the wither skulls. I'll be back in a little bit. Hi, everyone. I'm back, and I finally have everything I need. I have some splash potions of poison. I have some wither skull skeleton skulls, and I have some blocks of wood. Oh, hang on. Um, because... I saw this thing. Oh, not me. <laughs> that wasn't that didn't work as it intended. What if I do down here? Am I going to die because of this potion? I don't know. I've never used these potions before. Um, yeah. I have a bucket of milk. Why don't I use that? Oh, I don't need to use that. I need that in case the wither hits. Okay, so that's that. I have my axe. I have the skulls. Um. Is this is it, it seems trapped, doesn't it? I should have eaten something.
Well, it's a good thing to know the wither cheese still works. Thank you. You're welcome for testing that for you. Um, so I put in these chickens because I was hoping to get wither roses. Hi. Where are your friends? Not talking to me. And I don't. I guess I don't. I don't. I don't blame them. I don't blame the poor little chicken. <clears throat> Hi. I don't know what these wither roses are for. Poison myself again. Good job. I suppose it kind of serves me right. I need that chicken to move, though. Hi. What do you... Thank you. I may need to eat something here. Well, I, I know I need to eat something, but I thought maybe drink some milk. But that's not what I said. All right. Right again. Watch the chicken. Now I have five of these roses. One more wither. And now that the chickens are gone, I don't have to worry about this. This is, even this is a little bit too exciting for me. I don't, this is, yeah, I don't know. I just don't know. I just don't know. Just glad it doesn't, ooh, don't look up, don't look up. There you go, there you go. Where'd the, where'd the star go? Oh, I grabbed it. Okay. So there you have it. Wither cheese still works. Um, we now have three more stars. Oh, hey, that's not what I was trying to do, but hi. Three more stars and some wither roses. And now we have to figure out how to get to our place of employment. Um, is it over here? I think it, it may be over here. Where's the staircase that I built? Here it is. Here it is. All right. So, heading out to the um, AFK spot for the Ender, Ender, and we'll see you in just a moment. Hi, everyone. I'm ready to brave the void, and by brave the void, I mean put all my stuff in the Ender chest so I don't lose it. I don't know if you remember this spot out here. This is enough blocks away that no Ender people should spawn if we stand on it. Um, these are also bottom slabs, so they are non-spawnable, um, and I now have my inventory filled with food, I got a lot of food in me. Okay, that's good. A varied diet. Eat a varied diet. And I also have these uh, wood slabs. I also have an axe in case I, in case I need to make a, a change. What I'm going to do is build a safety platform. And uh, it's going to be pretty big so that I can build the Ender Ender on top of it without having to worry so much about the void. Especially since I don't have an elytra and yeah, elytras are no good. So, see you in a little bit. Ooh, that's a neat effect. Hi, everyone. Um, I'm out here over the void. I built this oak slab platform for safety purposes. This may not be the bottom, but it may be the bottom of the structure I built for the Ender Ender. Um, and with this done, I think I'm going to end the episode here. I need to gather some resources and actually figure some a little bit of figuring. Yeah, figure out a little bit of figuring. English is hard. And uh, so I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, leave a like. If you really enjoyed the episode, Leave a double like. I, that's not even possible, is it? Maybe subscribe instead. And leave a comment down below. To let me know what you think. Um, if you have an Ender Ender design in mind that you think would be brilliant, feel free to show it to me. I have not 100% decided what I need to do for the Ender Ender. So, thank you for watching. We'll see you next time on Geranderlandia. Goodbye.